If you have seen my previous videos on iOS shortcuts, you know just how powerful they can be. Today's video is all about the shortcuts you will actually use. Not just fun tricks, but 10 genuinely useful everyday automations that make common tasks faster, easier and way more efficient. Whether it's logging water, getting directions home or sharing your Wi-Fi with just a single tap. These are the kind of shortcuts that fit right into your daily routine. And as always, I'll show you exactly how to build each one step by step. Let's jump right in. Picture this, you have just finished a great meal at a restaurant, the bill lands on the table and you want to leave a proper tip. No second guessing percentages, no opening the calculator app or doing mental math. This shortcut makes it effortless. Just enter the bill amount, pick your tip percentage and it instantly shows the exact tip and the total to pay. It's fast, accurate and feels like having your own personal calculator custom built for tipping right in your pocket. Here's how easy it is to create this money saving magic. Go to shortcuts app, tap the big plus icon at the top right to start a new shortcut. First, we need to ask for bill amount, search for ask input and drag it into your shortcut. Change the question to enter bill amount and importantly, make sure it asks for a number so your iPhone knows it's about money. Next, we need to pick the tip percentage. Search for and add a list action. Here you will type in your usual tip percentages like 10, 15, 18 and 20. This creates quick buttons for you. Now for the math, we'll use something called calculate expression. Think of it like a mini calculator inside your shortcut. You will set it up to multiply your bill amount by your chosen tip percentage to get the tip. Then add another calculate expression to add the tip to the original bill to get your total. Finally, to see the results, add show result. Here you can customize the message to show both the tip amount and the total like your tip equals 15% and the amount or the total equals so and so. Give your shortcut a clear name like calculate tip. You can do this by tapping the little down arrow at the top and selecting rename. That's it. No more dinner table stress. We all know we should drink more water, right? Tracking water intake can be a motivator to stay hydrated, but between work, errands and everything else in between, actually remembering to log every single glass in your health app can feel like another chore. This shortcut turns tracking your hydration into a single tap or even a quick voice command. You finish a glass of water, tap a button on your home screen or just say, hey Siri, log water and boom, it's recorded on your health app. No opening apps, no searching for menus, just instant hydration tracking. Let's build this healthy habit helper. Start a fresh new shortcut, search for log health sample and add it. This is how your iPhone talks to your health app. Tap on the health sample, part and choose water. You will then see a spot to enter the amount. Think about the size of your typical glass or bottle. For example, if you usually drink from a standard glass, you might put 250 milliliters or 8 ounce. You can always change this later. Rename your shortcut to log water and save it. Pro tip for easy use, you can set this shortcut to run with a simple voice command like hey siri log water or even by tapping the back of your iPhone, a feature that is called the back tap which you can set it up in your iPhone settings under accessibility and then touch. That's instant tracking. Who do you call the most? Your partner, your best friend, your mom, your kids? Instead of scrolling through your contacts every single time or searching for their name, imagine having a dedicated button right on your iPhone screen that instantly calls them with just one tap. No fuss, just tap and talk. This shortcut is like creating a personalized call button for your absolute favorite person. It saves you precious seconds and simplifies reaching out, especially when you're in a hurry. Setting up your super fast speed dial is a breeze. Create a brand new shortcut, search for and add the call action. You will see a spot to choose a contact, tap that and pick the person you want to call instantly from your phone book. Now let's make it easy to find. Tap the little down arrow at the top next to the shortcut name. Tap rename and give it a clear name like call mom or call partner. To make it a button on your screen, select add to home screen. You can also replace with their image for easy access. 
your iPhone will create a little app like icon for it and when you tap it the call is placed. So easy right? Have you ever taken a photo of a receipt, a signed school form or some important handwritten notes and then realized you need to send it as a PDF? Usually that means downloading another app, trying to email it to yourself or jumping through hoops. It's a hassle. This shortcut is your personal document scanner and converter. With just a few taps, it takes any picture you select and instantly turns it into a professional looking PDF file that you can easily share. No extra apps needed, all done right in your iPhone. Let's make this image to PDF magic happen. Start a new shortcut, search for and add select photos. This tells your shortcut to let you pick pictures from your photos library. Important tip here, if you want to convert more than one picture into a single PDF, tap the arrow next to select photos and turn on select multiple. Next, search for and add make PDF. This is the action that does the converting. Finally, to share your new PDF, add share. This will bring up the familiar share menu so you can email it, message it or save it wherever you need it. Rename this shortcut image to PDF or photos to PDF. Now, the next time you have a picture that needs to be a PDF, you are ready. The classic party dilemma, guests arrive, they ask for your Wi-Fi password and suddenly you are just trying to remember that 16 character jumble of numbers, letters and symbols. Forget spelling out your complicated password. This shortcut instantly creates a special picture or a QR code that your guest can just scan with their phone camera. They'll connect to your Wi-Fi instantly, no more typing required. You'll look like a tech wizard and they'll be online in seconds. To get this, create a new shortcut, search for and add a text action. This is where we'll put the secret code for your Wi-Fi. A crucial step here, in the text box, you need to type the exact format but replace the specific details with your own Wi-Fi information. Your network name, this is the name of your Wi-Fi network, the one you see when you connect like my home Wi-Fi. Your password, this is your actual Wi-Fi password. Double check your spelling and make sure that the semicolons and colons are in the right place. Next, search for and add generate QR code. This turns your text into a scannable picture. Finally, add quick look. This will display the QR code on your screen so your guest can scan it. Call it share Wi-Fi. And the next time someone asks you, you will look like a tech wizard. Safety note here, be mindful of who you're sharing this QR code with as it contains the actual Wi-Fi password. Do you ever find yourself doom scrolling late at night, glued to your phone screen when you know you should be winding down? It's so easy to lose track of time when your phone is constantly buzzing and bright. This automation is like your personal bedtime assistant. At the time you choose, your iPhone will automatically dim its screen, silence distractions with do not disturb and you can even open a calm app like a meditation guide or soft music. No more getting stuck into your phone when it's time to relax. This one is a little different because it's an automation meaning it runs automatically. Instead of selecting my shortcuts tab, tap on the automation tab at the bottom of the shortcuts app. Tap create personal automation, choose time of the day, set your ideal bedtime for example 10.30 pm. Now let's add the actions. Search for set do not disturb and add it. Make sure it's set to on. Search for set brightness and add it. You can slide the bar down to a comfortable low level, maybe 20 to 30%. Optionally, you can even add open app and pick a relaxing app like Calm, Headspace, Podcasts or Apple Music to gently guide you sleep. One crucial step here, on the final screen, turn off ask before running. This ensures the automation works automatically without asking your permission every night. Hit done. Now let your iPhone gently remind you or even force you to wind down for a better night's sleep. After a grocery run, dinner out or online returns, you snap a photo of the receipt just in case but later when you actually need it it's buried into your camera roll between selfies and screenshots 
this shortcut fixes that. With one tap, it takes the latest photo, usually the receipt you just captured and saves it directly into a dedicated folder in your files app. Whether you're tracking expenses, filling for reimbursements or just staying organized, this is a simple way to keep all your receipts in one easy to find place. Let's build your personal digital organizer. Create a new shortcut. First, we need to get the photos or screenshot. Search for and add the action, get last photo. This tells your iPhone to grab the very last picture you took or the screenshot you captured. Next, search for and add the action, save files. This is how we get into your files app. Now, look at the save file action. You will see a spot that says destination. Tap on that. Here you can choose where you want to save your receipts. You might have folders already or you can create a new one. For example, you could create a folder called Receipts or Expenses 2025. Simply browse and tap on the folder you want. Once you have selected your destination folder, tap Done at the top. You might want to add a show notification action after save file to confirm it worked, like Receipts Save to Files. Rename your shortcut to something clear like Save Receipts or Save to Files. Now, the next time you snap a receipt, just run this shortcut and it will be neatly filed away into your chosen folder, ready whenever you need it. You know how it goes. A brilliant idea pops into your head while you're walking, cooking dinner, or even mid-conversation. But by the time you unlock your phone, find the notes app and open a new note, that brilliant thought has vanished into thin air. It's so frustrating. This shortcut is your instant idea capture tool. With just one tap or a quick voice command, your iPhone will ask you what's your note. You speak or type your thought and boom, it saves directly into your notes app. Never lose another great idea again. Let's build your instant idea catcher. Start a new shortcut, search for and add ask for input with the prompt what's your note. Next, search for and add create note. This tells your iPhone to make a new note. Make sure the note body selection is linked to the provided input, the text you just spoke or typed. Optionally, if you want to see the note right after you created it, you can add show note right after create note. Now, rename your shortcut to quick note. Pro tip here, just like with log water, you can assign this to a voice command like hey Siri quick note or back tap in your iPhone setting for super fast access. This is a game changer for people with kids. If I have to record a video, it usually takes three to four steps. Open my camera app, switch to video mode, hit the record button. But by this time, the moment is gone and the video is useless. This shortcut will make sure you always capture the best moment as quickly as possible. It's handy even for quickly capturing an emergency situation too. By the tap of this shortcut, your video will instantly start recording using the back camera. One tap and done. It's saved to my gallery as usual. To do this, create a shortcut. First action would be to take video with back camera. This just takes a video. You need to save it. So the second action is to save this video to the recent album. That's it. There is one downside you need to know. The maximum quality that this can record is 1080p due to iOS shortcuts limitation. So I use this only when I know that I need immediate capture where I might miss the scene before the three taps. Imagine it's late, you're tired, or maybe you're in a new part of the town after a long day. The last thing you want to do is fumble with your map app, typing your home address when you want to get back to your home as quickly as possible. This shortcut is your instant take me home button. With just one tap or a single Siri command, your iPhone will instantly open your Apple Maps or Google Maps and give you directions straight to your doorstep. This can work for any place, home, office, usual coffee spot or your favorite restaurant, anything. Let's set it up. Search for and add show directions. Important step here, for the destination, type in your full home address. Be very specific. You can also set your preferred mode of travel like driving or walking. Rename it to directions home. Now, whenever you need to get back to your home, just tap it and maps leads the way. No typing, no stress. And there you have it. 
10 incredibly practical and powerful shortcuts that will transform your iPhone from just a phone into your ultimate personal assistant. These aren't just cool features, they are tools that truly help you save time, reduce annoyances and get more out of your iPhone every single day. Let me know in the comments below which shortcut was your absolute favorite. And if you've created your own amazing shortcut that you can't live without, I'd love to hear about it. If you found this video helpful, please like this video and subscribe to the channel. I'll see you in the next one. This is Anjana. Bye-bye.